Yo, guys! Okay, I cannot be the only one, but there are some days that I really wish I could connect a GTX 1080 to my device and play some of the most demanding titles. However, what I can do is stream Steam games right to my Android device. So, here's how. Okay, guys. So, before we can get started, there are a few things that you need to check. First, make sure your phone and computer are on the same Wi-Fi network. Secondly, you need to make sure that you have an NVIDIA graphics card that's a 600 series or better. Now, on your Android device, download an app called Moonlight. On your desktop, open up the GeForce Experience app. Go to the tab that says Shield and enable Game Stream. Now, once you enable it, on the Moonlight app on your Android device, you should see your computer pop up. Click on your computer's name and type in a pen on a GeForce app that I prompts you with. Once the connection is established, you can stream any game right to your Android device. So as far as streaming performance, it's not bad. Now this is all going to depend on your setup. I only experienced one glitch during streaming, but for the most part it's very playable. Of course, I wouldn't recommend this for any high paced action games like CSGO, but for other casual games it's perfectly fine. And the graphics are pretty good as well. So keep in mind that these are downsampled, so you're not experiencing the full graphics quality that you would on your desktop. So games like The Witcher 3 don't look as good as what they look on a desktop, but that's so the game will remain playable over your network. So guys, that has been a quick look at how to stream Steam Game Trainer device. If you want to know how to do this over a mobile network, check out my website because I'll post the instructions over there. So guys, if you liked this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. And as always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for another galvanizing video. Thanks. I've been gone for a long time And a man has needs What can you give me in the meantime In between these